Oh, okay. Oh, a bit out of my chin. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna make a mess. We're gonna make a mess. Oh. Oh, hey. Uh, oh. Uh, are we ready to start? Are we ready to start the next episode of Two Guys, One Video Game? Uh, looks like it. Okay. Um, you know, thanks for letting us know the camera was on while we yeah. were enjoying this cup of ice cream. Hey, what's up? It is Chuck the Freak and, of course, James Hello. from Dave and Chuck the Freak. And we are two guys, one video game. The game we're reviewing this time is actually a suggestion from a listener who emailed us at Dave and Chuck the Freak at WRF.com. Uh, and we're going to review Mount Your Friends. So what Mount Your Friends is, it's like a super cheap download that you can get on Xbox Marketplace. It costs us, what, like a buck? It's like a dollar plus it's like a dollar. Yeah, so it's like an indie game. Uh, we think it's just been developed by one dude. Yeah. The game's been out for a little while, but it's brand new to us. We never yeah. heard of it until the email came in. Right. It's like and homoerotic Jenga. Is yeah. What it is. And instead of wooden pieces, you're playing as poorly designed, graphically, uh, humans. Human men swinging, you're swinging parts. your arms swinging. Around. You almost look like one of those sock things at like a grand opening at a car dealership. Yes. The opening music to the, the, the title screen. This is Mountain Your Friends. Yeah. You know, a sports like simulation. Yeah. Like it's funny. Like you can tell the guy who made the game is very funny. He's got a great sense of humor. Uh, you know, the music is like you're dancing at like a, a nightclub. Do 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 do. And then once you start playing the game, I feel like the background music. Is like something you'd hear in a dramatic scene during like Lord of the Rings or Jurassic <laughs> Park. Like it's intense. Like you know, it like once you start the game, it is on. Yeah. It, what surprised me is how badly I wanted to win this game. How badly I wanted to mount James repeatedly yes. over and over and over again. Yes. And I'm dealing with that issue not just in the video game but also in real life. Yes. So I'm used to it. So. Like the one complaint I have about the game is uh, controls. Controls are real wacky. You literally you use these buttons and your joystick to control which limbs go where and that kind of stuff. So it's hard sometimes to maneuver your character. I guess that maybe that's part of the challenge. It's not a game you're gonna buy because you're gonna invest hours and hours of your day playing. This is more of the party game. You invite some people over, you have some fun, and instead of you know getting under the influence and watching Labyrinth on Netflix for the hundredth time, uh, you play by your friends. It really reminds me of Sega Genesis, kind yes. of. Yeah. Um, but all in all, we had a pretty good time playing the game. All right, that wraps up another edition of Two Guys, One Video Game. Uh, I'm Chuck the Freak, he's James. And uh, remember, you can get a hold of us if you want us to review a game that you think we should review. Yeah, just shoot us an email, Dave and Chuck the Freak at WRF.com, and let us know what game you would like to see us review on the next edition of Two Guys, 